Understanding ovulation, a cornerstone of fertility. Ovulation is a fundamental process in female fertility. It's the event where a mature egg, ready for fertilization, is released from the ovary into the fallopian tube. This process is central to a woman's ability to conceive. Understanding ovulation is key to family planning, whether you're hoping to become pregnant or aiming to avoid it. Ovulation is intricately tied to the menstrual cycle, a complex series of hormonal changes that occur in a woman's body each month. It typically happens around the midpoint of the cycle, although the exact timing can vary from woman to woman. The menstrual cycle can be roughly divided into two phases, the follicular phase leading up to ovulation and the luteal phase after ovulation. The entire cycle, from the first day of one period to the first day of the next, can range from 21 to 35 days, with 28 days being the average. Understanding your own unique cycle and the timing of your ovulation can empower you to make informed decisions about your reproductive health. Whether you're tracking your cycle for family planning purposes or simply want to be more in tune with your body, knowledge about ovulation is power. The orchestration of ovulation, a hormonal symphony. Ovulation is not a standalone event, but rather a carefully orchestrated process driven by a delicate balance of hormones. These hormones act as messengers traveling through the bloodstream and signaling different organs to play their part in the intricate dance of reproduction. At the helm of this hormonal symphony is the hypothalamus, a small but mighty region in the brain. It releases gonadotropin-releasing hormone, or GnRH, which acts on the pituitary gland, another important player in this hormonal orchestra. The pituitary gland, in response to GnRH, releases two key hormones, follicle-stimulating hormone, or FSH, and luteinizing hormone, or LH. As their names suggest, FSH is responsible for stimulating the growth and development of follicles in the ovaries. Each follicle contains an immature egg, and FSH helps these follicles mature in preparation for ovulation. LH, on the other hand, plays a crucial role in triggering ovulation itself. Around the middle of the menstrual cycle, there's a surge in LH levels which signals the ovary to release the mature egg. This surge is the primary cue for ovulation and is what ovulation predictor kits are designed to detect. And decoding the clues, methods for tracking ovulation, understanding your body's signals and identifying your fertile window, the time when conception is most likely can be empowering. There are several methods for tracking ovulation, each with its own set of pros and cons. One of the simplest methods is menstrual cycle tracking. By keeping track of your periods on a calendar or using a period tracking app, you can begin to identify patterns in your cycle length. If your cycles are relatively regular, you can estimate your ovulation day based on the average length of your cycle. Another method is monitoring your cervical mucus. As ovulation approaches, the cervix produces more mucus and it changes consistency, becoming clear, slippery and stretchy, resembling raw egg whites. This change in mucus is a sign that ovulation is near. Basal body temperature, or BBT, tracking is another popular method. BBT is your body's temperature at rest. After ovulation, there's a slight increase in BBT due to the hormone progesterone. By taking your temperature every morning before getting out of bed and charting it, you can identify this temperature shift and pinpoint your ovulation day. For a more precise prediction, ovulation predictor kits are available over the counter. These kits detect the surge in LH in your urine, which occurs about 24 to 36 hours before ovulation. A positive result on an ovulation predictor kit indicates that ovulation is imminent. The telltale signs, recognizing the symptoms of ovulation. While tracking methods can provide valuable insights, your body also gives you clues about when you're ovulating. Paying attention to these subtle shifts can help you better understand your cycle. One common symptom is a change in cervical mucus, as mentioned earlier. This change in consistency is a clear indicator that your body is preparing for ovulation. You might also experience Mittelschmerz, a German word for middle pain, which refers to a cramping or aching sensation on one side of the lower abdomen near the ovary that's releasing the egg. Breast tenderness is another common symptom, often accompanied by slight swelling or increased sensitivity. This is due to the hormonal fluctuations that occur during ovulation. Some women also notice slight spotting or light bleeding around the time of ovulation. 
Changes in libido are also common with many women experiencing an increase in sexual desire around ovulation. This is thought to be nature's way of increasing the chances of conception. You might also feel more energetic, outgoing or experience heightened senses. It's important to remember that not everyone experiences all of these symptoms and the intensity can vary from cycle to cycle. Now, let's talk about their prime time for conception. This period, often referred to as the fertile window, is when you're most likely to conceive. It typically spans about six days, the five days leading up to ovulation and the day of ovulation itself. During this time, the chances of the sperm meeting the egg are at their highest. So if you're trying to conceive, this is the time to focus on. It's important to track your cycle closely to identify these key days. Remember, every woman's cycle is unique, so understanding your own body signals is crucial. Ovulation can sometimes be accompanied by mild discomfort, often referred to as Mittelschmerz. This pain is typically harmless and lasts only a few hours. However, if you experience severe pain or it persists for more than a day, it might be a sign of an underlying condition. It's always wise to consult with a healthcare provider to rule out any serious issues. An ovulation occurs when the ovaries do not release an oocyte during a menstrual cycle. This can lead to irregular periods or even infertility. Several factors can contribute to an ovulation, including stress, excessive exercise and hormonal imbalances. Understanding the causes can help in finding the right treatment options. Contraceptives, particularly hormonal birth control, work by preventing ovulation. They alter the hormonal balance to inhibit the release of an egg. While effective for preventing pregnancy, it's important to understand how they affect your menstrual cycle and overall reproductive health. Always discuss with your healthcare provider to choose the method that's right for you. Ovulation plays a crucial role in your reproductive journey. Whether you're trying to conceive or manage your menstrual health, understanding ovulation can provide valuable insights. Tracking your cycle, recognizing the signs of ovulation, and knowing when to seek medical advice can empower you to make informed decisions about your reproductive health.